I've got the substation reset. But if the grid's shorted once, you know it could happen again, right? You leave the electrical engineering to me, okay? Just get your ass to a safe zone. You're gonna have to spend the night there. I saw this freaking weird zombie. He's covered in big green blisters. It, it hauled ass as soon as it spotted me. You know anything about it? <laughs> Not enough information, I'm afraid. But if you see another one, do let me know. Okay, give me a sec. something come see me and to start with here's a uv flashlight and a remote control you run up on a volatile give him a face full of uv or lead him into a trap which you can trigger with that remote you got it got it perfect now for the bad news despite your efforts brecken's mission failed ah, shit is he okay he's alive but you need to get back to the tower jay called all the scouts in and that means you to have a meeting with the tower's leader. Acknowledged. Confirm his identity and contact us immediately. Sometimes I feel... 
me like there's nothing outside. Brecken's mission failed. Jade called a meeting in the tower. It's my opportunity to finally meet with Brecken and confirm his identity. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. He lost the rest of his team to Baitos and then Ryza's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him. And you've got to back me up, okay? For God's sake! You can't even walk straight! We need you alive, you idiot! Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right? Yes? Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just- Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right, you need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. Jade, a moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron. I'll be in touch shortly. Look, there's something else we need to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He took a blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Lora tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Anti-seizure drugs were being passed out like candy when the infection first started. I mean, the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Ghazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. His mother had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died two years ago. But Ghazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Ghazi can be very... insistent. So, they kept giving it to him. You think he's been stockpiling it all this time? If he hasn't, I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Ghazi lives under the overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. With most of the runners out of action, Brecken wants the scouts to take their place. That means me. We're supposed to go for the next airdrop, right before sunset. Jade will be showing me the ropes. Now that won't be awkward at all. Crane here. Rip 
report. Tower boss is named Brecken, and he's definitely not your man. The other likely suspect is this warlord, basically. Local guy. Calls himself Rise. He's hoarding Antizen and then gouging the hell out of anybody who wants to buy some. I'm on a mission to get Antizen from the airdrop. If I don't succeed, they'll have to come up with something else. Acknowledged. Good job, Crane. You're doing well. Stay on task, and we'll be in touch. Be sure to call us immediately if and when you get that Antizen.